Efficiency, efficiency, efficiency. And today, we're gonna try to up ours here at Merch Studio. Check this out. Let's make t-shirts. See, we use Digital Factory, right? Which is, when I open it, One hour later. It just takes forever. And when I try to rip a file, this is what it looks like. <laughs> the big one, see that? Not responding. That's a 4MB file right there. Buffer, 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 waiting, waiting, waiting. And right now it's 1221 buffering. And we do use this uh, PC, which is an ROG with Tungchen i7 graphics card and all that good stuff about my PC and this is what it's this is the specs right there and storage is not messed up either you know, I've got this three drives there I've got the storage drive I've got the software drive and I've got the Z drive which is a NOS drive so today so I'm gonna buy a PC let's go What the? Oh, shit. I still have some packages to ship out. <sighs> All right, let's go. All right, I am here at what is a guy's equivalent to Target. Right there. We're here to get some PC parts that we're gonna put together. So this is gonna be a fun little project for us. Ooh, dang that line too. I don't know there's like a crazy sale going on or whatever. I'm gonna have to check it out, but everyone's like buying computers right now. It's crazy. Check that out. Yep, this is where the line ends. So this is gonna be fun. You too. All right, that was super easy. Thank God I went through the internet, so I didn't have to go through, you know, and wait in that line. I came in, went to the internet window, picked up the stuff that I need. Which is, by the way, here's all of it, right here. Here's all of the stuff that I got. It was for 800 and something dollars for a 64 gig i7 12th gen with uh, one terabyte solid state drive, two terabytes of uh, hard disk for storage. Blah, 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 blah. Right here. All right, that's that. Time to go home. All right, I'm back at home and all the stuff right here, right there. And we will uh, we will chill for the rest of the day and put it together tomorrow. Why you always lying? All right, it is Tuesday, 8.17 in the morning. A couple of days after we got these parts for the computer that we're putting together, but Silly old me, I got a motherboard that doesn't have a Wi-Fi card on it. So I'm going back to Micro Center. I'm gonna replace that with one that has a motherboard. And yes, I know, I know. You just put a dongle on there, but it doesn't make sense for me to get a big computer and just plug in the Wi-Fi dongle. So I'm gonna go back there. But first, we're gonna finish shipping these out because right now, see these? Right there. These were orders that we printed out last night after the cutoff. We're doing two shifts now because we want to make sure that you get your prints as soon as possible. So our printer is powering through. We've been printing 15 hours because this one is working. This one's still giving us headaches, but we're fixing that. There's going to be a different video on that. But yep, so we're doing two shifts. And yeah, we're gonna ship those out this morning. Ask Mary Ann here, Prince, Prince the new batch for today. 9.04 in the morning, we got finished boxing these up. We have a busy morning, they're gonna be printing, but we are going to ship out these packages. So we're heading off to UPS, and I have some packages for Karasu, go through FedEx and USPS as well. So we're gonna take those two right here. And that, and after that, we're gonna go to Micro Center to replace that motherboard. And of course, it would rain. I love you, Texas, but man, weather here is crazy. First stop, FedEx at Walgreens. Right there. We got a few shirts. Right, thank you. Okay, thank you. 
All right, that's FedEx down. Next, we're going to USPS. Donuts. Stop number two, post office. All right. How you doing? Matt Ryan, you're gonna be a good Santa Claus. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Hi, how you doing? Last step before we get our computer stuffed, we're going to U uh, UPS. All right, we're here. Thank you. Have a good day. You too. That's that. So now we are going to get the computer stuff. All right, I dropped by the house to pick up another package because this client slash long friend has been with us since the beginning and you know worked with us through all the mess ups that you go through as a beginning or as a starter printer. So he's been there and he stuck with us and he needed it today. So I picked it up and I'm right here outside his office. I'm gonna look, uh, I'm gonna deliver it to him. How you doing? Hi, how are you doing? He's on the phone. So we'll wait a little bit. Yes, for friends. Let's drop it off. Oh, you want to drop it off? Yeah. Yes. So I'm just gonna drop it off. You want to Yes. Hey, how are you doing, man? I'm all right, man. How are you? I'm doing well. This is Fred right here. What's going on, people? So this guy has been supporting us since the beginning, even when we were messing up colors and all that stuff. He just kept, I don't know why, but he just kept coming back and supporting us. So <laughs> he's a really good friend, a great mentor. And we're going to come and visit uh, later on when he's not busy. Uh, and he's going to talk to us about business and all that stuff. But. Uh, when I was beginning, I uh, I brought an order over, right? You did, you did. Yeah, and it was I, I was so impressed. I was like, this is the goal right here. This is the goal right here. So he's been a great motivation for us, and hopefully you will, you know, we'll step up a little bit soon and get to his level at some point in the future. But this is the goal right here. Well, I'm so proud of all the all the strides that you've made so far, man. Keep up what you're doing, man. You're doing the right thing. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate, appreciate. <laughs> See, he keeps on pushing me and motivating me, so that's that's always great. Yeah, but I decided to just bring it over because I'm going to Micro Center to get some stuff. So I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna drive it over, uh, say hi to Fred, and do all that stuff. I certainly appreciate it, man. It wasn't expected, but I'm glad you did. I'm glad to see you today. <laughs> yes, sir. Me too, me too. All right, I got to go. All right, later, Can't Joe. stay. All right. Take care. Have a good one. Happy printing. Yes, sir. That guy's amazing. Fred, mm, I'm lucky to have met him. You know, one day he just called and started asking about getting an order and all that stuff. And, you know, he was ordering like a foot here, two feet there, probably just testing out the waters. And this was like right in the beginning, beginning when we did not know at all what we were doing. And there was one very particular order that we made for him and it was Royal Blue. But if you're a printer, you've probably experienced some issues with Royal Blue because in CMYK, Royal Blue is 100% cyan and almost 100% magenta. And so it kept printing out purple, kept printing out purple. On the screen, it looked perfect. It was Royal Blue, but we had a hard time dialing that in. And what we had to do was we had to do like test prints with different percentages of magenta until we got royal blue. As with anything that we do, you saw us in, you know, in one of the past videos for Tasha, we do a lot of test printing and test pressing just to make sure that everything's optimal. And that's a continuous process. And when, you know, when our clients reach out to us and tell us, you know, this is happening or this is a new issue that we have, we act right on it. These feedback are very, very important for us because this is a way, these are a way for us to you know, continue getting better at our process and getting better as printers, you know? So Fred, thank you very much for being awesome. I wanna be like you when I grow up and we're gonna talk more in the future on YouTube so that you can give us some tips and advice on how to grow as a business. Cause man, look at his setup right there. It's like in this big building with a gajillion staff members. So now we're really off to Micro Center, let's go. All right, after all of that, we are back with our stuff here at Micro Center and hopefully we can change it. Not, oh well, I mean, I'm pretty sure I can. 
Yeah, it says there you have 30 days to return it. And I'm not returning, returning them. I'm replacing them with something else. This is what I get for being a little dumb when I was buying this stuff. But here we go. Uh, well, I'm, uh, I'm exchanging my motherboard to this, and it's already up front. Mm -hmm. I am exchanging these two. All right, we gotta get out 30, right? right I'm gonna go get uh, anti-static bands and then come back and just pay for that thing. Out 30, anti-static bands. There you go. Let's go with that one right here. Go. It's over here. Thank you. No problem. Y'all have a great day. Woo. All right, mission accomplished. I've had more than one person, but specifically my friend Jeff from the Philippines, Jeff Boy, who's like my IT consultant guy. He does, you know, he helps me with everything that has to do with computers. He's like, why are you, why are you building this computer? It's like, let's put it this way. He said, you know, for the purpose that you have for it, which is printing for TTF, it's like you're getting a Ferrari to bring your kids to school. But I'm like, yeah, but isn't that cool though? Bringing your kid in a Ferrari, so. Yep, here I am with my overspec stuff just so I can print your orders uh, faster. And Chris Garcia in Austin, my friend Chris, this is your fault. <laughs> I blame you for this because when I went over there and I saw his setup, you know, he has an oddly, he used the same software that I use, Catling Digital Factory and Print the XP. But when he was doing that, he would click the print button and like in two seconds, it would be sent to the printer. And I'm like, I need that. I definitely need that. So here we are building this computer. And if it works, we're gonna get another one for the other printer so that we can rip faster, we can print faster, and we can chip out faster. All right, time to head home, get some lunch, and then build this thing. We are finally back home with all the stuff that we got. <laughs> Oh, this stuff, during the drive, I kind of realized I think I might have gotten carried away with this computer. But, you know, it is what it is. It's gonna be pretty fun putting it together. But this video has, I think, already gotten way too long. So we're gonna put this together in the next video. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> Hopefully I don't fry it. Hopefully I don't burn the house down doing it. But we'll see. Let's make t-shirts.